These are some Dinar Guru updates, starting off with Samson article quote, the World Council, Iraq is among the Arab countries with the most gold reserves. Iraq still maintains its 30th position globally with the largest gold reserves out of the 100 countries, including included in the International Financial Statistics for Global Gold Reserves in, for the second month in a row after purchasing 34 tons in the month of June, when these reserves amounted to 130.4 tons, which represents 9.5% of the remaining of other currencies. Frank 26, article quote, high foreign reserves of the Central Bank of Iraq. Uh, Frank says, yeah, very high because the government of the CBI controls the auctions, increasing foreign reserves instead of decreasing them by having Iran steal them. I love it. Pimpy says we're closer now than ever before to a civil war over there in Iraq. Article quote, Iraq is nearing the brink of a Shiite civil war, unquote. Pimpy says, until all this crap is settled, you're not going to see any changes whatsoever in the Iraqi dinar. We see they've done a lot of great things for the Iraqi dinar, more gold, more foreign currency asset buildup. But if they're going to have a civil war, the country is going to be unstable. This is not good. Caperoni says if the dinar is ever going to go up in value, it will be the result of Iraq building a private sector diversity economy, but only if they pass laws, encourage investment, and diversify away from oil. A country's currency exchange rate is never a random act. It's based on economic growth, GDP, etc. Only with the success and growth of Iraq's economy can the dinar go up in value. Mark Z via PDK, Mountain Goat, the new lower denominations that we're looking for are not yet in circulation. This is referencing um, back from the 16th from Mountain Goat. Mark Z says, I am told they exist by a number of folks that work in the finance ministry. Nader from the Mideast is saying, I think the first week of January, they're going to launch the 2023 budget. And the good news is the rate it's in it. But I don't know what the rate is, but the rate is in it. Samson article quote, Al Kazimi's advisor, the foreign exchange reserve represents real monetary stability for the country. Uh, Saleh said all indicators confirm today that the country's foreign exchange reserves, which amounted to about 85 billion, including gold, are at a high level of efficiency, represent real monetary stability for the country. Frank 26 says the generation that's there for the last 20 years they've never seen a currency of their own the generation before them 30 to 40 years old don't even live in iraq they ran away and that's why so many banks that are being established around the world to take care of all these iraqis the iraqi dinar is going to become a pivotal currency it'll be a currency hub iraq baghdad everybody knows the middle east knows it and mountain goat says i know for many of you, things seem hopeless for your investment, but I can assure you they are not hopeless. We will see a major shift soon in the USA. This will impact the foreign policy of the USA towards Iraq. It may take until the end of the year to catch up, so don't expect anything until at least January 2023. Things are going to change, and the future is very bright for Iraq. Lastly, Mark Z, the question, can Iraq reinstate its currency today, then later RV under the gold treaty? Mark Z says, we have been told that's a possibility, that that would be a near rate, which is uh, known as the nominal effective exchange rate, but I haven't seen that discussed in a long time.